Hello and welcome to another Walkthrough Wednesday at Walnut Ridge RV. My name is Chris Logan. And I'm Tim Newland. And here we are in front of the brand new, all redesigned Passport. This, this Passport is a 2950, that's the model number, BH, bunkhouse. And you can see a great new front cap. Um, just a really clean and nice look. Um, nice rock guard there. Going over to here, I'll just pass along. Got a huge pass-through storage area. You can get plenty of things in there, really advantageous for customers. And you have the nice magnetic grab handle up the top, so you don't have that uh, little plastic piece holding on. Very nice quality. Moving down here towards the door, Chris will show you. We have this really nice uh, solid step that goes down. It can handle uh, anything you throw at it. I thought Chris was going to show that part. Yeah. <laughs> He's supposed, to, <laughs> He's supposed to step on it when I mentioned it. Listen, you know? guys, it's organized chaos. Yeah. Okay, listen. Back and forth. And okay, I was waiting nice. to do it, and he I just jumped right good. up there to it. <laughs> so these are the steps, as you can see. They flip right up in there. It's nice um, and easy. And then that's a nice, sure, sure platform. Tim, what else do you see out here? Yeah, One Tim. really nice thing that I like on this is the doors. You see how that's got friction hinge door on it? So it, the wind's not going to take that along and slam it shut on you and pinch anyone's fingers. Southside kitchen, little refrigerator there. Hey, yeah, one feature I like to point out about the Passport is the spread axles. Dan, if you go down there to see the spread axles, the wheels are further apart than on most coaches. Passport calls it load equalization. I think that's a great term for that. Just keeps some of the wheel hop out of it, keeps it planted to the ground a little bit better as you're going on the, on the road with a lightweight trailer like this. Yes, and another great thing is on this unit, the 2950, you have the double doors, but as you can see, your awning goes over both of those. So you really have a great outdoor living space and the outdoor speakers to complement that. Let's go inside. Let's do it. After you, gentlemen. Let's start in the bedroom. Look at the, um, all passports have a full queen size bed, 60 by 80. Um, if you look under the, um, the wardrobe, sir, they don't go all the way down. What that gives you is your arms under there rolling around. You're going to be able to do it or if you, in a little nightstand if you needed to put something on there. And I really like these cool doors. Go on in, Tim. <laughs> <laughs> well, this gives it a nice clean look. Yes, it does. But something that's really great in here, really makes it feel open, is the arch radius in your roof. I mean, that really, for a tall guy like me, you're going to need that kind of space, you know, as you're coming through. What are you, six, seven, six, eight? Almost. <laughs> uh, going on to your dinette, it's the larger U-shaped dinette, so you can fit tall people. You know, I'm going to need that when I get in there. Well, what I like as a real man myself is the eight cubic feet refrigerator so I can store all my food. And you can see he needs a lot of it, so you can handle it all. That's what's great about it. You have the trifold sofa right here. That's going to fold out. Plenty of sleeping. And a nice television set. What more can I say? One more thing I can say is as we go back in here, it's a really awesome feature on this. You see you have the back door into this. So if you have a uh, canoe or a kayak, something like that, you can just fold this right up. Chris is going to open that up. Boom, look at that. You can get anything Hi, in there. Hey, hey guys. So you got a really nice, cool back door so you can open it up just like this. And uh, with this arch roof, you really get a nice, you know, a little bit of space and open this fill for people that are sleeping up in there. And then, of course, we're going back into the bathroom. You got the tub surround and that extra door so people can go in and out right to the bathroom, not have to track through the whole unit. Another neat thing I just realized is um, it's got a, a flat surface here over the stove. That gives you a little more counter space, a little more workspace, and a natural backsplash there. You know something the really new cool. And Furion. Tim, would he's light up as well? Yeah. <laughs> this is the new Furion stove. Um, just a nice, clean look. A little more efficient. Okay, now you're. Sure. What'd you and last there? but not least, what's really great? The Jensen uh, player right here, CD, DVD, AM, FM stereo, Bluetooth compatible. Really does a whole lot of features for you, so you can listen to anything you want to listen to. And guys, one of the great things about this full-featured coach. It weighs 6,250 pounds, so you know your SUV, um, most anything could pull this pretty well. Anything yeah. else, Tim? Well, on the really great side, you can't see it right here, but it does have that enclosed underbelly. You know, heat, you know, going to keep the pipes warm. Really gives you great extended season camping, so you can use it for a long time. Okay, guys, 
Thanks for letting us walk through Wednesday with you. We really appreciate you. Let us show you around. My name's Tim. Yeah, and again, thanks again for another walk through walk through when walk walk, 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 through, walk, through, Wednesday. walk through Wednesday. My name's Chris Logan. <laughs>